All right, let's talk about blowing up things in the woods. Okay, so this song, one of the only songs on the record that started on an acoustic guitar. So it's kind of based around this um, kind of just uh, open chord pattern. So uh, let me play just the basic pattern of the song, and then we'll get into the trickier parts. So... So what we have there is a it's it's just kind of a really rhythmic strum pattern that the whole band is doing together. And the chords are G, C, E for the first bit. And then the same thing, but to A, A major. And then that's just to an upper octave of the E. And then we go to this weird A thing where I'm kind of, uh, I'm basically playing only the second fret of the D string and the rest of it's open. I'm kind of doing this little arpeggio. So let me play it the way like the the kind of electric version that we we do it now. So obviously uh, just the drums and the bass kind of start off. Guitars just starting on some G feedback while those boys do their thing, and then I come in on the the. Um That brings us to the verse. So, uh, okay, so here's the here's the verse. So we're going G, meet me at the corner store. And that's uh, E minor, and then a B major. Midnight, and if you bring 20 bucks, then we could have a real good time. And then the pre-chorus is C to G, to E, C, and then that weird little lazy, absent-minded, whimsical A chord. Back to the verse. And then pre-chorus again. One, two, three, four, and then that's where we get to the chorus. So the chorus is the same chords that I showed you at the very top of the song, but this time we got a little bit of tricky shit happening. So let me just play it for you, and then we'll go from there. All right, here we go. So we're following the chords, um, and I'm using my thumb to basically play the root note. So we're starting on the G, and I've got this little arpeggio thing. So that's the that's the G, or sorry, that's the third fret to the fifth fret on the B string and open G string. So, um, and then you're just playing the D string open as well. So let me just show you. You got to mute that A string. Uh, so here's how the chorus goes. I'm going to play with a little less distortion so you can hear what I'm playing. This is what I played during the chorus. I'll do it slow. So, uh, again, the chords are G, C, E minor, G, C, A major, 
G, C, high E minor, and then to that ominous A chord. So let me, uh, let me do this slow, real slow for you. And then basically we hit that little post chorus. So that's basically just going from same. It's I think it's the exact same chords as the chorus, uh, just a different rhythm. So here we go. I'm doing this little walk, this little uh, this little kind of lead um, in the G G pattern here, where it's just a bunch of pull offs. So it's kind of my like rip off of that like uh song viceroy by mac demarco uh just way simpler and dumber so uh again so i'm kind of keeping keeping that root going because we don't have a rhythm guitar player so i keep that root that g going while i do the lead so it goes a back to g so, with distortion, it's like... So we just do the same verse, and then it does that. So, so we go... Meet me at the corner store at sundown And if you bring 20 bucks, then we can burn this And then we go from the B to the C, to the B, to the nothing. One, two, three, four, then same thing, chorus. Uh, they wouldn't understand. A little early in the morning for that. And then I basically take it up the octave here. So I do, I, I start it down here. And then we hit. So again, that's just up the octave. So um, you're keeping your first finger around the 12th fret. You can use your your pinky if you're a cop, uh, but usually you just use your ring finger. Uh, and uh, so it goes. And then I kind of hit these harmonics on the B and E strings. That's it. E, A, and that's it. Then the explosion goes off. So that's the song. It's a little, tr this one's a bit tricky, I'm not gonna lie. Um, with all that kind of arpeggiating in the chorus, you don't need to do all that stuff though. Like, you can just go. You can hit that. You can just hit that arpeggio. But the full thing is is got a, a bunch of a bunch of pull offs and stuff. I think I illustrated them pretty slowly at one point. So if you want to pick those out, they're there for you. The main one you got to hit is this one. And this one. So anyways, I hope that's there. I hope that's easy for you. I hope you get it. I hope you dig it. Don't blow things up in the woods, but listen to our song about it, please. God bless.